came first as a rehab patient, and then I came as a, a, get, a resident. What brought me to Cerro House was my ankle. I broke it in two places, and I came to Cheryl House for rehab. And I wanted to learn to walk again so I could go back to Goddard House. But in the ensuing days and months, I have decided that if you have to be somewhere, this is the place where you want to be. The best part of a Cheryl House is whenever you need anything, you get help. And I like the idea of talking to different peoples and listening to them and talking to them and all. It just makes my life inspirational. In the Food is good, too. <laughs> when we sing while we're exercising, we have exercises three days a week. One of the girls comes in and plays the guitar, and we all exercise and sing the songs. We have night nice services here, too. Once a month, we have a, a communion service from the Episcopal Church, which is lovely. And there are all kinds of uh, different services on as well. The music program at Show House is important to me because if I can possibly fit it in, I will attend any and every program that has a musical uh, bent to it because music to me is one of the most important parts of my life. And uh, that's why I, I feel blessed to participate in activities at Cheryl House. I'm connected to the pastoral care department. I visit residents. I conduct a religious service, which is very dear to my heart. We're able to deliver short-term care, long-term care, and Alzheimer's care here in the city in which people resided their whole life. Because we're a not-for-profit, we don't deliver money back to shareholders. We have stakeholders, our patients, our families, our residents. They very much need and, and, and deserve to be treated as the person they were before they got here and able to deliver on things that will make them comfortable while they're here. Our greatest strength here at Cheryl House is clearly our employees. We've created an environment here that, that people generally tend to stay at Cheryl House. It's nothing to have a 20 or 25 year CNA or a, a manager that's been here for 35 or 40 years. With that level of continuity and that level of institutional knowledge, uh, our staff is able to deliver a product that I think is the envy of the industry. I certainly believe that Cheryl House is uh, positioned to be a leader in elder care now and long into the future. Our basic motto here at Cheryl House is they who care heal. That sounds very, very simple, but caring is simple. Our families, our residents, whether they're long or short term, feel cared for. They feel secure and they're comfortable. They've been treated with dignity and respect. We try to identify the issues that are important to them and deliver on those. We kicked off the first capital campaign in our organization's 100 plus year history to do one thing, and that was to ensure the quality of life for our residents here at Cheryl House. There have been seasons of my life and this is the season of my continuing to give. And if God's willing, I'll be doing it for a long time. I think if you have to be someplace, this is the best place to be because all your needs are attended to. I just like being here, period. The end. <laughs>